You're so big. You can barely fit on that table. If I move it, we won't even be able to see me groom you. Nope. Can you hang out there while I go get my stuff out of the car? I mean, you jumped up there. You're welcome to jump down. You know what I'm saying? I'll be right back. Let me go get my stuff. You can stay there or you can jump down. It's up to you. Okay, big boy? I'll be right back. Let me go get the, my clippers out of the car. Okay, I just walked outside, and I'm going to make this a members-only video in just a minute, but I just walked outside. I just got to the salon like an hour and a half ago, maybe, and I just walked outside to get my bag. Look, right? And this guy, this guy right here, look at this bug. This guy, how beautiful he is. Look, he's green. And if you only knew what I'm going through right now, if you only knew what I'm going through right now, this guy, why is he at my doorstep? Literally, in front of my door. If I would have just walked, I would have just stepped on him. And look how beautiful he is. He's like green. So I have something that's going on and I won't know the truth until like later this week. I won't know the, the facts. So I'm gonna put this guy over here in case it's telling me something. So we're gonna put this over here. Goodness. All right, so I um I got some crazy news today, but I don't really talk about my personal life on here. But I I know what I know best is I know how to work. It's my life. And those of you guys that are watching right now, that are watching today, which is 20 September, which I might need to remember that date for the rest of my life, but 20 September 2023. If you're trying to really take me down and which you there they were almost successful yesterday on some platforms but if you're trying to take me down and you don't know me and maybe I won't close this down for members if you're trying to take me down because you hate things that I'm doing you're not here like you don't know me at all I would put take off my shirt and give it to you some of you guys came in here to get help. The lady with her name was Jay, with your chow chow. Like you're out there, you're you're breaking every public, every policy and every proceed, like all your policies and everything that we're supposed to follow. Community guidelines. You're breaking all of y'all. Break every community guideline to try to attack me and take me down. When the fact is, I've never done anything wrong. But today I had I have some heavy things going on and you'll soon know. You will soon know if it's true. And the heavy things is a life or death thing. So you know, I'm not going to make this a members only. This is real. This is real life. So um What I know best, if you don't know me well enough, here's how you know me. I work my butt off. I, I can sleep here. That's how much I work. Um, the rescue pit that I picked up had puppies. Yeah, I took responsibility for them. And I'm caring for them with all my might, with every donation to buy food and vaccinations and hopefully get them spay or neutered, including giving them a PTSD training platform to continue forward on. This guy, this guy was a gift to me. 
The people who hated me so much that said, I go buy doodles and da-da-da-da. He was a gift. And so was his sister. A gift because at a time where I was developing an extra large and large dog up stand, I could actually not show you that we had them in stock because I shut my business down for nearly two years through the pandemic so that I could follow the law. We were asked to shut our businesses down and stop leaving our houses here. I did that. And other YouTubers that groom dogs surpassed me and that's okay. I did what I thought was right for myself and for my clients and for the law that they put out for us. Policies. I kind of am a policy follower because I, I was raised in the Air Force. I served my country. I gave my body, mind, spirit, soul to the Air Force and I became their property for more than seven years of my life. And I, I work so hard that I don't have, you hear you want more? I don't have a husband, a boyfriend. I hardly hang out with friends. When volunteers like Rebecca come out and help me, I can barely give her time to say thank you. I might get a date for lunch with Cynthia three times a week, but I'm on a time limit. I sit down and say, hey, I got one hour for you, babe. I got to be out of here an hour and a half. The other night, Cynthia brought me lunch and she sat in my, she sat in my garage where we were, where we were, where it's, there's tons of stuff for sale. She sat there and waited for me to talk to a client, interview an applicant, set up a training with another guy, and then I finally sat and had two bites with her before I had to get back to work. She was so sweet, she brought me dinner. If you don't know me and you're trying to attack me and you don't have the facts, that's why some fans will actually say, where's the proof? We're not jumping on your bandwagon, where's the proof? Because it's funny that somebody who takes everything live, including this day, right now, that we, I take everything live to a point that you get to sit, wait, watch, and watch me groom a dog live that might hurt me, attack me, bite me. And some people are like, I hope it bites her. No, this is dangerous, but I'm taking it live so you can see exactly what I'm doing. And the owner can see exactly what I'm doing to their dog. And they can walk right in here and say, you're hurting my dog, stop. But it's not the case. I'm giving them the opportunity many other people that tried to groom that dog didn't. To be able to make choices for their animal that they can see and watch. So I'm here because this is all I know. And with breaking news coming in my life and I still have to wait for one more phone call before I know the truth. I know how to work and I'm going to work with you because this is all I know. I've spent my life on YouTube, I've spent my life on Facebook, I've spent my life with animals. I have 20 years I just celebrated on September 5th. We celebrated on the 9th. I have been grooming dogs. I will come out at 3 in the morning for somebody. I'll show up at midnight. I will come out at 6 p.m. after I've taken a shower and already sat down to eat dinner. I'll put my dinner aside to come out for you. That's Dee Dee. That's who I am. And what I know best is right here with you. So in my lowest moment, which is right now, it just happens to be right now, I just need you with me. So he has to get groomed. I've neglected him for a few days. He's really hot. He's standing here, it's air conditions on, and I have to groom him. Hurt or not, going through pain or not, going through loss or not, I have to groom him. He needs a groom. And I just found out like hours ago of a possibility, and I don't know the truth yet. I'll tell you later. If it, if it comes to pass, you will know. We'll go to the funeral together. Some people don't know the whole story and I won't tell it. Not, not now. Don't fall off. Don't fall off. I won't tell it, not now. Maybe in a book. I had a lot of respect for people's privacy. A, mo a lot, not all, but a lot. And it's funny because we can watch like Jennifer Lopez or Oprah Winfrey or The Rock and we can make judgments and we can pass judgments, you know? I really, really check myself, and sometimes I have to check myself twice, like, stop, like, you're, that's a video, you know? 
That's a video. You don't know everything that happened there. You weren't there. That's a video that might be edited. You weren't there for that. And that chick with the chow chow, she was here. When she cried out there because her dog had ticks, I held her. A couple weeks later, I said, hey, when are we grooming your dog? I need you to get help. Can your brother or your dad help? I'll even come to you. Like, I have no hard feelings. But sometimes people get so hateful. And you can't have hate where there's love. You can hate all you want, and that's because you were going through something, or you went through something, or you've been through something. And I've been there, and I know it. That's why I know that hate, you can't get love through that hate. You're going to have to pick. You want to follow hate and the devil? Go ahead. You want to follow love and God? Go ahead. You can make a choice to come over here. But when you hate to a level that you wish death, that you wish hurt, that you wish harm, you are pretty much walking the line of the devil on your own. And hate wants more hate so that they, they feel like there's abundance of you guys. But there is over 311,000 followers, and maybe some of them are haters so they can get every video. There's over 60,000 followers on Facebook. I'm working on 60,000 followers on TikTok. And out of all these thousands of people, yeah, there's hate. But there's a lot of love. There's a lot more love than there's hate. So I challenge you, if you're getting here, hater, and you're going to take this and do a meme with it, go ahead, I'll see it. I don't care. Like, you can't touch me. Not here. Not me. You, you can't. You can't touch me, and I protect uh, around me. I protect everyone I love out there. Because I pray for all of my fans when I pray. The fans that really care. You've been attacked. I pray for you. By, the, by my haters, I pray for you. I surround you with love and protection because they can come at me, it ain't going to touch me. I'm not perfect and I'm not 100% like, I'm perfect, nah, but I'm pretty strong. And I always said this, I always said this even five years ago when that hate would come delivered at my doorstep, at my grooming salon, on the phone, at voicemail, all that hate y'all haters do for attention. And sometimes I give it to you. Like a little bit right now, but there's a lot going on right now. You will know soon what, what it is. I want you to see this. I'm not what I was doing an hour ago, but right now I want you to see the vulnerability, the realness, going live, no editing, uncut, the truth about humanity, love and kindness, forgiveness and compassion. Because somebody who looks like this cannot abuse dogs, cannot kill dogs cannot harm dogs. Someone who lets you, the owner, sit with me while I groom your dog who's gonna kill my ass. I'm not hiding anything. I'll never hide something like that. Hi. Look how hot he is, he's so hot. So this video, if you're out there, or not. This video, this live is for David. If you're out there or not. The good times and the bad. Because I'm going to download this video later and I want to be able to remember this moment. Whether you're out there, David, or you're not. Because in this moment, at this moment in my life, was when I found out things that I might be crying over tomorrow or not crying over. And with a lot of prayers, you can pray good thoughts right now. Just pray for David. Whether you're out there or not, this video is for you, David. Thank you for all the years that you helped my business. Thank you for all the years of up and down, traumatic experiences with you, the good, the bad. This video is for those people going through those things with someone they love, whether it's a family member, sister, brother, husband, son, girlfriend, boyfriend, fiance, wife, husband. All of those people can also cause happiness, sadness, traumatic, it, traumatic experiences. Sometimes you will not get to say goodbye. And I tell you guys that all the time. Hear me, please.
these are some moments. This is 2017. David and I, right here, beach. We went to the, we went to um, Dog Up Stand in Pennsylvania with that. Yeah, I don't know, some funny pictures. We had some funny times. This is when we met a long time ago. And then y'all remember this, right? Right? David was with me to pick up the doodles. But David, if you're out there, this video is for you. Thanks for all the years. And if you're not out there, well, we'll know soon. All right. In the meantime, let's get my clippers out. Because I know this is what I know best. And I gotta change my shirt too. All right, guys. Is anybody else crying right now? Does anybody is anybody else crying? Can I get some like blue hearts? Even if you don't know what's going on, is anybody else just feeling emotional about what I said? I got a bravura there, blah, blah, blah. I got the 10 blade on that. We'll change the 10 blade to that. We'll do a 7 blade, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, you need to be, you need help. You do definitely need help. And we'll be doing a color class here in the next couple weeks. So I want his coat to start getting ready because I like to take my time in doing their coat. Like I usually like to do like uh, the air dry. Thank you, Pookie. Hey, those are your change my shirt. I forgot you guys are here. I guess I'll go ahead and wear this. I wore this today already one time. I went and did uh, some grooming at a senior living facility. Lupe, are you out there? Hey, Lupe, I just did your, I just did your stuff. Oh, I'm going to cry, but it's okay. I got you guys here. All right. That, that, excuse me. All right. Whew. Like this is all I know, you know? This is what I know how to do best is work and work hard too, right? You're always working. David would always say, even when we would go on vacations because I would bring my work with me, David would say, you always work. You know, even on vacations, you're always working. I don't really have all the facts, but I know that what I do know doesn't look very good. But let's just push forward and maybe we'll get some we'll get some information tomorrow. So we're gonna do a seven blade on him because he's so hot. And his hair, I don't know if you can see, it's so thick. It's just so thick. No matter what I do, it's just so thick. And imagine if it was like this. Oh. Um, yeah. At night, he's like, <laughs> All right. Thanks for helping me through this minute, this moment. I appreciate it. I'm so sorry, Teresa. I'm so sorry to hear that. You're going to feel cool before you know it. And then count my words, because I, I, I predict a lot of things. I, if, if this is real, I predicted this a long time ago. But this guy, I'm going to shave him down, and I'm going to predict within 10 days we're going to have cold weather. Like literally cold weather down here. 
we're gonna go, it's gonna be like winter. It's gonna be cold, cold enough to be like, ah oh, man, see, I should not have shaved him, but he's too hot. And so we gotta make sure we get all this off so his night times are a little bit more comfortable for him. Okay. Randy's here. I asked her, I didn't know that I would be here right now. I wasn't sure kind of what to do or where to go, so I went ahead and um, asked her to come out. Oh shoot, there's one thing I do have to do, hold on. Let me see if I can do it right here. Goodness, man, my heart just hurts. Okay, hold on. Oh no, it's not even showing that we're live. Not over here. Okay. Woo! Let me go check one thing over here. Okay, will you wait for me or do you want to come with me? You can stay there or you can come with me, it don't matter. I'm just going to go right across here for a minute. What's crazy is anybody that's joining us has no idea what we talked about earlier. If they're joining right now, they have no idea what happened earlier. You're going to have to rewind and watch it from the beginning. And if you do do that, you might want to become a member. This is a great opportunity to become a member because... You can see how to become a member in the description of the video, which means you click on the title depending on your device. Because this, this video may be hidden later on. All right, so let's see about, um, we're gonna do this. This is here, let me do this thing. Hit that like button for me, folks. Appreciate ya. Looks like 22 likes already, I appreciate that. If you're just joining us, please subscribe to the channel. That always helps. And let's go with this, we'll go here. We'll do the live chat, okay. Yay, cold weather, Lupe wants some cold weather. Lupe, man, thank you so much. She gave me a $15 tip earlier today. You are the bomb. Did you go pee somewhere while I was out there? Did you, why are you wet here? Did you go potty in here? Did he go potty in here while I left? Did you pee on my bag? Somewhere, if you peed on my stuff, I'll be like a little something. So I'm going to give you a little something, something. Okay, let's go ahead. Um, she's going to do a color on him for in two weeks. I think we'll be all right. Why are the lights flickering? It's sunny outside. They flickered twice. They flickered twice already. Did you guys see the first flicker? I'm not joking. They flickered just now. They almost shut off. Did you see it? It's never been with my clippers, so why would it be now? 
Did you see who saw the who saw the flicker just now? And then who saw the flicker 20 minutes ago? Turn the air down. We're both going to be sweating here in about four minutes. This is really tough stuff. This is what I'm going through right now. It's just, I, I'm holding it together because you guys are here. Did anybody see that? I saw the flicker. Sarah saw the flicker. The first flicker or the second or both? Who saw both flickers just now and a few minutes ago? If anybody's here and needs to say something, please let us know by flickering the lights. We appreciate it. If anybody's here, please let us know by flickering the lights. Thank you. seven blade down with my five speed. You can check it out at myfavoritegroomer.com. I would love your purchase. If you have anything to say, you can flicker the lights. We're here watching. Those of you guys who just arrived, if you later on want to watch the very beginning, there was something in front of my door that I brought inside. You know how the butterflies always come with me and hang out because of my dogs passed away? And the, uh, lots of them, I've showed them to you. They've been in here in my room. Can you see how thick this hair is? Look how thick this is, how tight it is, and how many hairs are in there. It's not matted. It's thick. This can't be matted. There's no hair to be matted. It's so thick, like cotton. Imagine wearing fleece. Have you ever worn fleece while you're watching TV and it's not cold and you like start to really sweat? It retains your heat inside the blanket. That's how he probably feels all the time. Don't stop. All right, all right. Wait, were you looking at something? What were you looking at? Those of you guys watching the feed, will you rewind and see what was he, what, where was he looking? Was he looking at something over there? Were you looking at something over there? Doesn't it cut like butter? It does. The five speed is awesome. I think you should get one. Right there.
Okay. This is called the groom loop cover, so it doesn't hang his head. Sarah, thank you for your donation. Woohoo! Keep it coming. I love how the the bug was green, and I love how your name was green circle green. Maybe I should put my scratch right here. You know how I don't like making a mess. Hold on. Do that. Did he get out of that? Yep, he could get out of that. I'll tell you, sometimes when you change your seven blade from one blade to the next, what you'll find is one blade is sharper or duller than the other blade and or may have different lines than the other blade. So if you happen to change your seven blade and you see different lines, like pay attention because you might be making more lines than you might like and you'll have to come back and fix it with the other seven blade once it's cool anyway. You're looking at yourself in the mirror. Oh, are you looking at yourself? Hey. <laughs> You're so silly. Thanks, Sarah. I appreciate you. It's been a minute. I hope you're well. How does he look right now? He's so cute, huh? He's so cute. He's kissing me. <laughs> Thank you, Charmsy.
Well, you love peeing on yourself. Let me take it off. He's so tall. There's no he, there's no no way around it. I'm gonna have something made for um, the dogs that do that. You guys are gonna need to get it. If you have a tall dog. If you have a tall dog, it doesn't matter. If he's trying to mark Saki's spot, which is down real low, he's gonna have to pee on himself to get it. <laughs> He, right? You want to pee on yourself. You got these tall legs. You, you want me to touch you? You don't want me to touch you? Lupe, your dog's uh, three or four months old. This is a dog that started being groomed at three months old, okay? This is how they act. Your dog is right on that track. That multi-poo, right on that track. What's he, three or four months you said today? That's what I'm saying, this is how they act. Does he act like that when we're not grooming? No, he acts like a wild maniac. He's that child that you're like, get back over here. In the store, like, get back over here. That's him, that's him. He's partying all the time. I'm gonna, did you see the flicker? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna I'm like gonna break right now. I'm like gonna totally crash right now. Oh my goodness. That's three flickers, okay? We never have flickers here. How many lives have we done together? We have never had flickers, but today, today, last night at 10 o'clock at night, today, this morning, this day, today. It's a big deal, so let's see if it keeps happening. If it keeps happening and the evidence comes in, I'm gonna let you know. I'm gonna let you know, and you're gonna come back to this video. I wanna mark this right now with this live video. You guys mark how many flickers we get through this whole video, you hear me? And I'm hearing you. This is a bit much though. This is this is my this is my home. This is the safest place I feel is right here. And this was David's favorite dog. I just happened to need to groom him. I brought him here yesterday. I didn't do it. Today I said, "You're coming with me." And boom. It happens to be his favorite dog, too. That's why I said, "What are you looking at?" Susan, yeah, Suzanne. All three, three flickers so far. I have never, we've never had flickers here. Okay, don't be like, it's a light bulb. No, we have never had flickers in this room. No, not like that, not live. No storm, sunny outside. There's no storms out there right now. It's hot and sunny, it's bright. I know what it is. I hope it's not. I hope that's not what it is. But if it is, I know what it is. That's four. That's four flickers. That's four. Don't be saying that. <laughs> Don't be saying that, AC. I was, um, I was with my most favorite fans. Remember when we gave birth to Angel? My hardcore fans, you guys were there with me for like 10 hours. And in this moment, even if it's not true, in this moment right now, I'm with my hardcore fans. You're right there. My hardcore fans are right there watching these flickers. Okay, let's keep going. And if, if it is, he knew that, he knows that. David's like, all you do is work. And I'm like, I know, you know, there's, I have so, there's so much, it's so much on my shoulders. Are you gonna keep 
keep flickering? Like, are you going to keep flickering a lot now? Like for the rest of my YouTube career? Like all the time? <laughs> Which light is it flickering actually? Is it the LED lights? The overhead lights? These LED lights? Or are they all flickering? <laughs> Whoa. Why am I show always showing you guys things that are just like godly? Like what? That butterfly. Those butterflies. All those butterflies from all the YouTube years. honest with you, why don't I have Kleenex in here? I got paper towels. I need to blow my nose. I need to not do that that way because there's wrinkles there and if I don't do it, like if you can't see it, don't take it, okay? Let's get to, oh, I got all the nose over here. Okay. It's great because I can constantly chit chat, stop, let that blade cool a little bit. I'm going to go back and find out what the favorite color is, too. What is this? Why is it green? Why is it green? I'm telling you, this is gorgeous. Let me get the paper towel to show you. This was at my door when I went out to get my grooming equipment. It was not at my door when I walked in an hour prior. Can you see the color of this guy? It's gorgeous. He is gorgeous. He's, glow he's green. Wow, he's so pretty. Like maybe over here, even his underside is pretty. He's at my door. What? Why were you at my door, you know? Why was he at the door?
next dog I'll be fixing is this guy any day now. I gotta put together, wait for some money, work and work harder and get him, we need to get him neutered. That's the next thing that we'll be doing. Number seven blade. Oh, four. Number four flicker. Any more flickers? It's been a minute. Are you giving me a time to work and not be interrupted? <laughs> All right, up. Water, it's really uh, dry in here, it's kind of sticking a little bit. Water with my favorite spray bottle. Dog up sand, because guess what? That's why I have it made. This is the XL. Up. This is why I got doodles. XL version, so he can stand up while I'm working on them. My camera actually, just because it didn't, the lights didn't flicker, I walked over here because my camera turned off. Just saying. It was a yellow screen. It shouldn't even be working right now. It had turned off. stand up for, which is back here. Flicker, you see it? And I'm going to be honest with you. Have you guys noticed it was uh, over there, and then it was right here, and then it was over there? Another flicker. Flicker five or six? Five. Five, uh, five, flicker five, and a yellow screen on my camera that my camera turned off for a minute. I'm 
really glad I'm, I'm live right now because I couldn't make this up. I could not make this up. Thank you. What I'm waiting for is just the lights just to literally turn off. <laughs> like, turn off and back on, all of them, just like off and on. And then I'll be like, okay, I believe. <laughs> Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you? Because you're live with me right now. There's no way to cover it up. It's like, boom, boom. What, the freaking live turns off. You know what I'm saying? Let's go back with the template on that. Template in the armpits.
right, now we just got a big head, huh? And the beetle, right, AC? <sighs> Nothing yet, no news yet. No news yet. Hi, Jean. Hello, everybody. Ma'am? This one? This one? Stand on this one? Stand on this one? You know why he doesn't like it? Does anybody want to guess? Doesn't like feet brush because there was a time where the feet were matted when we were trying to decide to leave them long or short, half or not, low or high, and his feet were not in the best shape. So brushing them out, he did not like it. So at that point on, he will always now not like it for me to do anything with his front feet or even some of the back. And I realized after six months, I think seven months, I was like, okay, we're just, we have to take it down. He's miserable. I'm miserable. I can't keep up with the brushing. That's why I also chose Joodles to just show you how much work it takes, you know, to really upkeep them if you want to keep them in the condition that we see some Doodles, not all, some, and very rarely, right, do we see those Doodles fluffy duffy. That was, uh, by the way, um, well, did you see what that was? That four guard. That was a four guard down the tail. Don't sit down on the blade, please. Don't sit yet, please. Good boy. I gotta do this, man. I gotta clean that up back here. You know, I'm I'm gonna leave a little bush for you. All right. Don't look at me like that. I. You see the way he's looking at me? I mean, you can't see it, but you see him look back at me like, what the? I've I have to go, but I've been subscribed a while. You're the best. I admire you so much. You got this. Sending a virtual hug. AC. Mwah. Thank you so much for your donation. Woohoo! Keep it coming. Thank you so much. Thank you so, so much. Hmm? Private part time, right? Get in there, it's pretty funky monkey. Somebody in my head just now say, well, why don't you do his face first and then go do that? I don't know, but 
I remember that comment. Do you guys remember that? Well, I can't believe you did the sanitary first and then used the same blade to come up on the face like nasty. <laughs> he's dirty anyway. If you saw what he licks and eats, you would be like, he's nasty anyway. Dogs are nasty. Thank you, Teresa. And yes, Teresa's going through something too. Please pray for her as well. Say a prayer for David. And uh, we'll get some news soon. We'll see what happens. As soon as I know, I will share. Down there is what I want to clean up. I don't want to clean up your head, because cause when we do the head, then we're done. But we can play around. You want to play around? We do ten blades, full guard. I say full, full guard. And see, what is this? This is actually an Andis, and it's kind of not laying very flat for me. There you go, Forgar, Andis, Tim, Tim Blade. We'll do a Forgar down, which is going with the hair grain that way. But um, I don't know that I want to go that short, honestly, but... Okay, we're already in it. Let's get our two guard on. I gotta save something for the color. You don't wanna look up for me? You don't wanna look up? Let me see. Let me see. Look up. See how he hangs his head? That's why that groom loop cover is so important. Because he would just be hanging his head on this. So now I do want him to look up so I can see what's going on with his chin. No more light flickering, huh?
Can you feel that dust at all? Pookie Puppy, woohoo! $50 donation, thank you! Woohoo! Yeehaw, woohoo! Thanks for your donation. That's such a big donation. Keep it coming. It's, it's pink. <laughs> Thank you, Pookie. Okay, we're gonna come in. Let's use these thinners here. So the short ones I have. Let me just kind of come in here and clean up some of this stuff here with food, eating, licking, chewing. All that making out you still do with Angel. Okay, all that licking, yeah, all that. I like to clean my brush out with my comb, like that. Thinner, let's look at the other side. Don't do anything crazy, these are scissors. Remove all that. Okay, let me check this one. Okay. You see? You see? Anybody see orbs? Is there any orbs happening on your end? Fan. Hello. It's been a tough 24 hours just been trying to get everything packed for myself. I'm so glad you're here. I'm so sorry. You get to spend this time with me going through this stuff too. If you're just getting here, be sure you watch the beginning of the video. And we can all use some prayers right now if you can please pray for us. A big prayer for David. If you can spare the prayer. Say, God, please have him safe and okay and delivered from harm. All right. Look over there. Look over there. Doesn't he look like he's going through the wind right now? You're going to really need to listen to the beginning, Chimmy. We need prayers for David tonight, please. I'm sorry for your loss. Doesn't, don't you look like you're going through the wind? Please, look. <laughs> okay, let's, let's clean it up. Look at, he's got this smirk like, get, come on, finish already. What I like to do is get it all in his face because then I get to see what's going to be in the way when he parties like an animal.
I don't know why, but every few minutes, every few seconds, my heart just kind of sinks. It just sinks. As if I know something already. And I hope I'm wrong. You don't act like this in the backyard. No. You don't act like this when Angel's around. No. She's your girlfriend, so you freaking love her, man. You're all over her. Like, you're so madly in love with her. As soon as we get up in the morning, you run to go check on her. Yes, you do. You're such a sweetheart. You're so in love with her. But do you remember the first time she came into the house? You did not like her. You didn't know what she was doing in the house. Do you remember that? Huh? Do you remember? Look up. Look up. First you're looking up. Oh, there you go. Look up. There you go. Do you remember? We got to make you look handsome. Yeah, we got to make you look handsome. For Angel, look up. Look up. Good boy. Good boy. Let me get it all. A little bit more. Good boy. That's a good boy. Yes, it is. That's a good boy. I got these thinning shears and blenders and chunkers at myfavoritegroomer.com. I don't want to take very much off, just a tiny bit shaping this up. And this is pre-bath, so you might want to do it after the bath as well. It's late in the day, but I wanted to get him his cut and let him air dry through the night. And it's really hot here still in Texas on 20, November, 20 September 2023. It was the lowest morning that I've seen. We had like a 74 morning, but it got to the 90s in the afternoon. No, don't do that. This is tickly, but I don't want anything going into your teepees. No, sir. I keep those out, okay? Okay, I'm gonna leave your ears so we have some like oomph to color. So we're gonna color some of your ears later. We have a color class. If you're interested and you're local, check it out at myfavoritegroomer.com. Book the color class. It may also be under our Facebook page under events. Okay, we're gonna do his sanitary. Brush this all out before you take him to the bath, okay? This is really hard for me. Uh, it doesn't seem like it, but I'm focused and I'm glad you're here. I could not do this without you. And if I wasn't here right now with you, if you didn't watch the very beginning of this video, you maybe you can go rewatch it and you'll know what I'm talking about. But if I wasn't here with you, I would just probably be crying and not being able to think. So thank you for being here with me. I really appreciate it.
my breath. Can you stand up? Would you mind standing up? I want to laugh, but I'm also crying. That ridiculous face. <laughs> that ridiculous face. What is that look anyway? <laughs> How can you not laugh? Look at your ridiculous face right now. Huh? My tears is dropping from my eyeballs. Don't get all happy. Don't get happy right now. Don't do that right now. We are on YouTube. Don't do that. Don't, don't get happy right now. Calm yourself down. We don't need a bunch of all that, this and that riffraff going on. We do not need that. Let's see this one then. And this one. pre-grew. You look great. I mean, your feet, we still need to do that, but still, you look great. I like the length of the cup, uh, the length of the hair. It's going to grow out a little bit more before we do the coloring, so it'll be perfect. It can air dry. It's cool. It will be cool for him. This is seven blade. Ten blade in certain areas. Ten blade sanitary, obviously. Four guard down tail. Four guard down, down head for half of it, and then two guard down on the top where the eyebrows are, left the ears alone, brush that out, really light through and through on both sides of the face, real light, just kind of evening things up, not taking a bunch of chunks off. Not bad, not bad, that's not bad at all, okay. What he does sometimes do is he gets these uh, tangles, all the all doodles can get these tang tangles through in between the digits, in between the toes, so we want to look in between and make sure there's not matting. I'm gonna take my ear shears, which you can get the point tip, five and a half, seven and a half scissor, use those to come in here and cut in between the toes. So I wanna to look first. I'm gonna go ahead and take, nothing that's not matted, but I'm gonna take out this color 
maroon where he's chewing. Okay, I'm going to take that out while I'm in here looking around. What's great about coloring is sometimes the imperfections of the haircut, like trimming all this, it doesn't matter right now because when you color it, it just it's not a big deal. Wait, wait. If you don't know what you're doing with these scissors, take your time. He's my dog. I've known him for quite a while. So and I've been grooming him a long time. So I know a kind of it's his body a little bit more than just a stranger's dog. I'm just getting in between the digits at this point. So let's go this one. And since he wants to sit down, I'll do this one next. He is pulling at me. He does not want me to be in there. It doesn't mean I, I'm not able to do it. I still need to get my job done. I still need to get his haircut done. Maroonish. Right when his sister was not exactly, hold on. I tried a, um, that's mad. It, that looks tangled from licking. I tried a probiotic on the dogs and they had a major reaction. All of my dogs had a major reaction. And his reaction was chewing his front legs. And if you can't tell, right here where I shaved all that off and his feet here were really bad. Right here, that discoloration there. Watch that into the table. And uh, I took him off. Within four days, that probiotic ruined like five of my dogs. They were chewing and like bloody. They were chewing until they were bloody. I took him them off the immediately off the probiotic, and we've been in repair since. And then recently, with him and his sister, because his sister is having the eye allergy problems, we've been switching food as well. So we're going into maybe month three right now, maybe month four on the new food. I'm going to get a, give it a little longer. They seem to be taking it well. It was the original food that they were fed as puppies with the breeder. So I went back to what mom was eating with their mom and then what they were eating when they were born to try to get rid of all this problems, allergy problems. Could it be from the environment? Heck yeah, it could be from the environment too. And I just recently got all of my grass because I took my doodle... From the salon home, when she comes to the salon, I'm wondering if she's allergic to the rescue cat because she would come here and get flared up. It's either chemicals, because there's chemical smell when you walk into all the shampoo and stuff. It is what it is. If you walk into Clorox place where they sell all that, you just get hit with that smell. So here, I don't get hit with it no more because it is, it is shampoo conditioner. But if um, a family member comes in, they, they've told me I can smell like the chemicals that are here, you know. And not here, even in my house, because I have everything at my house, too. Because remember, I moved everything home for a little while. So we are working with to see if it's the food. And then with the female doodle, I have brought her to the salon where she was doing great with her eye, and it flared up. So I wondered if, it was, if she's allergic to the cat. She loves the cat. And brought her home. And with the grass that was like, again, this year as well as last year. Last year is when it started, the eye flare. This year bringing her back to the house and letting her play in the dried grass that day and the two, three days after that, her eye was just like we'd never even done anything, like it was back to day one. So I recently got the rest of my yard pea gravel. So it's all pea gravel and now her eye is doing 80% better. It's not gone away, but it's not doing what it was doing when I first took her back and she was running through that dry grass again. So. So many problems when you're trying to figure out allergies, you know? Okay, here we go. What they're allergic to. The next step is a $1,500 veterinarian bill, which I have it on the schedule. I've moved it out twice now. Just to, I want to try every other way first. Because even when I went and got allergy tested, it, it showed I was not allergic to anything. But when ragweed showed up the other day, I was knocked out. I was, I was sick. Because it showed up. For one day, I just was knocked on my feet. Did anybody else get affected with that ragweed the other day? You just, I was taking some medicine, or some allergy meds already within my system, so it didn't hit me so hard. It made me weak, tired. I didn't get a fever, but I had um, hot flashes, and it just lasted a day and a couple hours the next morning. 24 hours and then a few hours. And then I was back at work. I think I was even here that afternoon working with you guys on the live. No, let me see. You 
you're really chewing this out back here, huh? Maybe something's bothering you. Let me look. Wash that out pretty good. What is this? Maybe some dirt in there. You okay up there? I haven't caught any light fix uh, flickers. Have you seen any? I'm just doing a full, all the feet trimming with this scissor. This is not the ideal scissor to do that. Okay, Dee, get your other scissor out, please. Now that I'm past the front feet, he seems to be doing a lot better, huh? Okay. Oh my goodness. Um, thoughts just keep coming and going, coming and going in my head. I know you guys don't know a lot of a lot of it, but there's enough, there's enough for me to go on and there's not enough. I have to wait for a call. Okay, let's do the pads with the 40 blade. I put my 40 blade in my to-go box today. Let me see. Um, so we'll get our bravura out. Change it over to a 40 blade on my bravura. Okay, we'll get the dog up Sam real quick, get him standing up so he doesn't have to do that. A little bit of support here. Come up, please. Turn around this way. You can do this with it, okay? This is the XL. We're going to put it under the tummy. Rivera. Here we go. Sorry, hold on. There you go. Now this one. Is Shimmy still out there, or did she come and go? 
So Shimmy and I have messaged each other back and forth. Remember, she's in Japan. And so if she had a family loss, my heart hurts so much because I, I have a feeling I know who it is and it's someone, one of the closest two people that you might have, one of them. Uh-uh, that's the end of the table, no sir. Wait just a moment. You're doing so good. Doing so good, hold on, hold on. Doing so good. Very good, I know it's taking me a while. I just want to be really careful and also get every all the hair that I need to get, but nothing else. I mean, you are licking it, so, you know? But at least now the hair, the grass at home is gone and I can really see if that's, you were licking that or you were licking just regular. Okay, here we go. Last one. Excuse me. Excuse me. Come on, bud. Got it. You got it. You got it. Nice stretch out there, stretch and bring it back, stretch and bring it back, change the subject, stretch and bring it back, stretch and bring it back, plus stretch and bring it back, and stretch and bring it back, and stretch and bring it back, and stretch and bring it back, stretch and bring it back, stretch. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> okay, all right, fine. I'll get rid of that and we'll do it. Ready? Stretch and bring it back. Stretch and bring it back. And stretch and bring it back. Stretch and bring it back. Stretch and bring it back. Stretch. We can play a game. I'll play a game with anything, you know? And bring it back. Stretch. Good, good. That's good. Yeah, see it so for me. Good job. Good job. High five. High five. This one, high five. <laughs> Good job. Good job. Let's change this a little bit though. Okay. Stretch, stretch, and bring it back. Okay, stretch, and bring it back. Stretch. Thank you for leaving it out there for me. Bring it back. Move that foot up. There we go. Okay, that's looking good there. All right, let's do one last look on his face. New doggy dance routine. All right, let's do it, Sarah. Thanks, Ryan. Hello. It sure would, Miss C. Peterson. Thank you for your memberships, Teresa C. Peterson. Everyone out there that's a membership that's not writing, thank you so much for being members. Grandma Shell, Pookie Puppy, thank you so much. C. Peterson, thanks so much for Welcome Level 1. Woohoo! Shimmy, thanks for being a member and a moderator and or a moderator. All right, let's do this. MP, thanks for being out there. I think, are you out there, MP? She might not be out there. I don't see her name right now. Maybe I saw it earlier. I thought I saw it earlier, but I could be wrong, but I did call her. It does sneak up on you. All right, well...
He's pretty much almost done. I need to double check these nails because he does play around outside. However, yeah, there's nothing to take. However, the dew claws you should always check. Yeah, there's not much to take, but there's a, you take the edge off. If you want to take the toenail class, let me know. Okay, that one. there you go. Not much because he does run around on concrete a lot. We did that uh, short for you to see. And back ones I know are good, but it's not, it doesn't hurt to look. You might find something that you wish you saw earlier. Okay, that's good. That's good. That'll be good. All right, now let's double check right here your face. There's, a, there's this area around your eyes. I need to lower this so that, um, you know, there's nothing pulling. And then I want to see your eyeballs here, okay? So let's see here. So I did that whole trim right there, okay? So we, we pushed his skin back and then just came this way. Because his eyes are very diamond-like, they like a cylinder diamond that way. So when, he, when I let go, see, you don't see it, but that's why the hair gets in his way from, you have to come at the straight angle here. Like this. His eyes are like this when he closes his eyes, his eyelids. So that's why I want to come back and check it one more time to really get that open right there. So I, when I talk to him and look at him, I can see his eyes. He really talks to me through his body language. Try not to trim the hair on the bottom underneath the eye because then there's a big line and it's hard to, you can't cover it up, you have to, you have to let it grow back out. All right, let's look up. Huh? What? What are you thinking? I don't know if I want, I, there's something I want to do, I don't know that I want to do it, I'm not sure yet. I do know we have to sweep the table though, okay? Can we come down? Let's sweep the table. Uh -uh, you have to come down. Come down. Let's go. Wait, wait, let me sweep the table. Okay, the table is swept. You may do whatever you want with the table at this point. Man, that looks good. You look like you're going to be cooler already. He owns the place. You didn't know? He owns the place. You want to have a little talk? You want to have a little talk with YouTube real quick? You seem to know me so well. Let's move, we can move this this way. Let's get over here. Over here. Hmm? Hmm? I'm going to put this up. 
have a talk with you two before we decide what we want to do. What's in my hand? What's in my hand? Nothing's in my hand. Can you don't do, don't lick that and then lick my face. Don't do it. Don't. What they lick, they lick everything. They eat everything. MP. Hey. You guess you got to go um, watch the beginning of the video later. I don't really know what to say right now. I'm waiting for some news. If you didn't watch the beginning of the video, please go rewatch it. We're waiting for some news. I'm pretty sure I know what's happened. You have to watch the beginning of the video to understand any of this. But I've said it for so long. I said wear a mask for so long. I've said, you never get to say goodbye sometimes. I've called out this exact thing happening, if it's real, many times, because there's been so many warnings. Y'all don't know about that. It's personal. This particular incident that could happen to most anybody. Wow. Betty still visits me every day on my fence. She comes as a bird and she says hello every day. I see Betty every day. She passed away in June. I knew you were going to do that. I knew you were going to lick yourself and then give me a kiss. I knew you were going to do that to me. I knew you, I told, this is embarrassing. This is embarrassing. You licked yourself, you cleaned yourself, and then you gave me a kiss on the cheek, almost really close to my lip. There's so much hair. There's so much hair blowing around. So I'll say it again, and I hope you hear me. Please, hear me. Even if it's somebody you don't really love all the time, you don't get to say goodbye sometimes. And we'll know soon, and I will share it with you one way or another. Your prayers for David will be awesome right now, no matter what hardships there have been in the past. I've been taught to hold grudges, but I don't like to. For anybody. So, thank you for being here with me. There's something, um, I really want to leave the live on until I find out tomorrow or the next day or the next day. But I guess it might take days. It's going to be gut wrenching to wait and wait and wait to find out. This is really big. This is not a little thing. This is a really big thing. So thanks for being here and sharing this moment. I had to go live because I've gone live with most of my life events on YouTube and Facebook and you know all these different places. This has been my life. Thank you for sharing it with me. I can't even look at you without possibly crying right now. Like not even that little cry, like not even that cry, like that, like that cry. As soon as I'm off, like that, that table out there in the lobby is going to get banged on. God's going to get yelled at, like that kind of cry. Like no cry, that no, you lost someone deep, you know, like no, that kind of cry. So we'll find out soon and I will let you know one way or another. 
You've seen me through some really awesome stuff. You've seen me travel. You've seen me help so many people, so many dogs. You've seen me through most of things. Not everything is out there, but it's been live. And I've shared it with you with no editing, you know, no editing. My personal closest fans know all the truth. And really, the only thing I care about is God's truth. Because you can't get me here, you know. You can't take me down because I know where I belong. I know where I'm at. I know what I've done. I follow rules. I follow a lot of rules. If that means I can't stick up for myself because I would be calling someone out, a lot of times I don't stick up for myself because I am the creator and the content creator. I'm the content creator. And when you try to stick up for yourself, you kind of attack someone else. And so I, I have it a lot. I might say, no, I didn't do that. No, that's not a fact. Where is the fact? I don't like that. Get off my page. Bless yourself. Go somewhere else. You know, like <laughs> all these different things I might say. It's not like you want to be silent because it's not fair. You know, life is not fair. But every strength and ounce of love and God in me will stand me tall and not in fear of anything that anyone in this earth can do or be or attack. So I wanted to, this whole groom, I've been thinking about like leaving a candle here, you know, and letting the candle just burn until we figure it out. But I know that what if it's Friday or Monday before we know anything? I don't want to do that. I have other grooms coming too, so I couldn't designate that. But I tell you this, when we find out news, you will know. And if we have to designate time for burning a light of some sort through the night in remembrance, then we will do that together. I promise you that. Because then we will be doing it because we know something. And if we don't know something and it's not true and it's not fact yet, then we don't know yet. Even if everything lines up perfectly in your mind. So I love you guys and thanks for watching. I'm going to take him to the bath, which is in the other room. And then we're going to go home and get some rest for a work day for tomorrow. Thanks so much for being here. Thanks for subscribing. Thanks for becoming a member. Hit the description of the video to become a member. If you know who I am, talk about who I am. If you've seen me, talk about what you've seen. If I've been in your house doing a groom, how can I also be the people call me someone else? It's impossible. You cannot have both of those types of attitudes all the time, every day. You will snap, you will break, and when you do, you will be who you really are. And I have never in years done that at all. You know, drill sergeant, yes. Little general, yes. Boss, yes. Bossy, yes. You don't know, but if you didn't show up for work, I'm going to be upset, especially if you live in my house. If you left me sky and dry for two weeks, I'm going to be upset if you live in my house. Like, I'm going to do that. Y'all don't know all that. And I'm not going to be the one that's saying who did it and all that. But I want you to see, like, the idea of, like, yeah, I would be pissed, too, if you left me for two weeks and you weren't, weren't at work for two weeks. Uh, yeah. What you don't know, you can't assume. You shouldn't assume. You should just straight up ask this direct question. We're going to go. And I hope you had a good night and thank you. I did this because I needed you. And I'm really, really happy you showed up. Because I see you. And I see you too. Do you see him? He's just so special. You're so special. But if you go home and party, this is not how he acts. No, he does not act like this at home, right? The people that game with me, get off of that! Like, he is all over! He's a wild animal! You're a wild animal! But did you guys see that where I was showing you how to do the leash? Did you see his tail wrapped around my hand and my arm and wrapped around my head? His tail, he loves me, you know? His whole tail is wrapped around my whole body. Hmm? Hmm? Have a good night. We will keep you updated. <laughs>